Do you know? The must see opera in this life. You must know. Tarandit is a three act opera composed by Giacomo Puccini. The script is adapted from the creation of Italian playwright Carlo Gazzi. When Puccini was alive, he failed to complete the creation of the whole play. After Puccini's death, Franco Alfano completed the whole play based on Puccini's draft. The play premiered on April 25, 1926 at the Teatro La Scala in Milan. In this opera, Puccini adopted the tune of the Chinese folk song, Jasmine. Tarandit's story was first taken from a collection of Persian stories called, The Thousand and One Days. Tarandit's word comes from the Persian, Tarandokt, which is composed of the words, Turin, Turin, place name, and, Dokt, daughter, meaning, daughter of Turin. The outline of the story is as follows. In ancient China, the king ordered that if he wanted to marry the princess Tarandit, he had to answer the princess's three puzzles correctly, but if he guessed wrong, he would be put to death. A Persian prince came to propose, but the riddle failed and he will beheaded at the moonrise. After reuniting with his father Timur and maid Lur, Lu, in Beijing, the Tatar prince Kalaf, who was in exile in China, saw the execution of the prince of Persia, and Durando personally supervised the execution. Prince Kalaf was attracted by the beauty of Princess Tarandit, and ignored the opposition of his father, Luer and the three ministers Ping, Pang, and Pong. He answered all the questions correctly. It turns out that these three questions the answers to the puzzle are, Hope, Blood, and Tarandit. But Tarandit refused to admit defeat. She against his father and didn't want to marry Prince Kalaf, so the prince came up with a puzzle. As long as the princess knew his name before dawn, Kalaf would not only not marry the princess, but also willing being executed. The princess caught the prince's father Timur and the maid Luer, and tortured to extract a confession. Luer committed suicide to keep the secret. Timur accused Tarandit of being ruthless. At dawn, the princess did not know the name of the prince, but the strong kiss of the prince melted her ice-cold heart. And the prince also told the princess her real name. In the end, the princess did not announce the prince's real name. Instead, she announced that the world will marry the prince and said that the prince's name is Amore, which means love in Italian. For more update, subscribe to our channel. Click the show links and enjoy watching the videos.